side by though. Tax railway across Ten Testra. to the old uh, furnace railway from our side to sand side and then to um, what would have been a viaduct that's uh, long gone now but uh, take it along with us. signal box in distance. The semaphore signaling which is unusual to see now. These have been replaced by uh, coloured light signals. So at this point the Incaster branch would have split and gone down what is now a dirt track. And that's the bit that we're gonna walk. It eventually walks and walk all the way around heading towards the south side. And eventually come to where there was a viaduct, a big viaduct that crossed the uh, the river and it continued on to Incaster Junction where it met the West Coast Main Line. So we're going to pick the track up now, just behind the station, the old station, where the show is. We're going to pick that track up. Um, but first we're going to go and have a walk into what would have been the old goods yard. The old goods shed still there, and uh, possibly the site where the old coal um, stairs was. We'll have a look, I'll bring you back uh, when we get a bit nearer. So I'm looking back now towards the outside box. This is where the Incaster branch would have split the old furnace railway. And um, it's obviously closed. And we're going to follow it back this way. So we'll take you back this way. So as it left back at station, it would have gone to the left towards sand side but before it did that um, there was a a good yard here 
and there should still be a good shed. I think it was on right move for sale. It gets sold for about 130,000. But it looked like there was an old coal yard as well when you look at some of the pictures. We're walking down to what would have been the old good, good shed and good yard. On the right and on the left. So that boundary wall would have been, I think it looked like coal saves. We were going to the coal yard to your, to your left here. Looking at the map, it looks like it's coal stairs. So it's a bit of a bit of a coal yard, but that's the old good shed. I say we're up for sale on the uh, right move. Yeah, they said it weren't. You couldn't make it into an house. It was office space or something. Well, this would have been part of good yard, wouldn't it? Yeah. Like the old original gates, maybe. The uh, good yard. I think they're still aren't they? They look like they've been here for a good while. Yeah. So, so that went, that bridge carries the wine to Carnforth. This would have been good, yeah. Let's see if I can find a picture uh, online and drop it in. If I can. Only a small good yard. Well, I suppose you wouldn't need a big one. Hand size only a small town. We're going to head now back to what would have been the main line, going to uh, Hencaster Junction. We'll bring you back when we get on it. So we're now on what would have been the old railway line, heading towards Sandsand. Railway will go straight on the on uh, road, it's 
been filled in, so we'll have to make our way to the other side and bring you back. Yeah, the, uh, it would have come under the road, but yeah, we're on track there now, but it would have, where we couldn't get through, we had to pick it back up here, it would have gone under a bridge, but they have filled it in, like they're trying to fill the rest of them in. But this is a cutting, isn't it? Approaching what would have been station down here. When you do that side to side map yeah. and you put your cursor on, it, it does show the station building and the good shed still here. But they might have been changed now. Back at Shift Inn now, aren't we? Yep. So, Sandside Station will be coming up through this gate, then. And I think it's part of this um, builder's yard. This line last saw traffic in 1972. Yeah. Carry coke from Durham. To the furnace, iron furnace. It makes you wonder whether that Smardale, because that was um, to that carried cork yeah. and wine. Mm. Through that fence is where the station was. We can't get down there, we'll have to walk along somewhere here. Yeah. So we're roughly round about workstation and good yard would have been for some side. Looks like we've come up on some. No line kilns are there.
get an echo, it's alright. Yeah. Looks like remnants of lime all over it, isn't it? Right there. Yeah. Well, it's blocked off, it would have gone through, I would have thought. This is the old wine kiln at Sandside. Something similar to the one that we saw at Smardale. Beautiful view into it, this dress for me. So the railway ran on our left, now in a cutting. You can't get there, no access. Like a unit on there, industrial unit. It would have gone under a main road that we're going to meet in a few minutes. I can't make out whether the station building is still there. I just can't get any access to it. It would have run through there. This bridge has been filled in years ago. It would have gone through a cutting again, under the road, and headed out towards that B-Lar viaduct that we're going to go and walk down towards. At this point, this is where the railway would have gone under road, so we've been a bridge here. And it across underneath it, or pass underneath it. We're going to go and uh, cross over and see what we can find. Is that an old railway post? Looks like it. Looks like it looks like it would have been a fence post. The railway. But we would have been down there because there would have been a bridge there. So we've backed down to the track down again. It's been filled in, hasn't it, years ago. And that way it's railway fencing. The line would have been on my right now, and this fence that I'm at side of would have been boundary fence for railway. We're going to cross over onto a, a stile, which would have then taken us back onto the track then again. And then it would have crossed over the road here, like, a little bit further down here. Nice, isn't Parts at uh, Bridge Daughter there, as it was sandstone, and they look like sandstone. That one yeah, especially that one. Yeah, it looks like it's had something in it. So they just dismantled it and chucked it here. Definitely that was like the side of some kind of, you know, as though it's been a post and it's yeah. like a gate. Um, it's a gate. It looks yeah. like bridge type brickwork. It was quite a big viaduct. 
Yeah. Well, it started here where this banking finishes. It crossed over here and it goes across. This is where the whole walk stops. It would have been a big viaduct that spanned this area and it would have been picked up again the line more or less with my fingers pointed straight down there that clump of trees oh let's see if i can find a picture put it in at the end so you can see the viaduct for today's walk that's about it i think